Um, <clears throat> okay, so this is um, His Grace's speech. Christ is risen. Risen indeed. Thank you. I have never actually fully written a speech before, so here we go. If you thought that a simple complication like laryngitis would stop you from having to listen to my address, then ha! <laughs> He did. Yeah, honestly, there. <laughs> and Marianne, I think it's very inconsiderate that you're able to micromanage absolutely everything down to the weather and not be able to sort this out. We'll have words when you get back. <laughs> you hear that a lot, don't you? From that's not enough. Looking out, that's just my prophetic nature, and seeing so many young people, a big marquee, and days of planning makes it seem like EYC 2012 all over again. <laughs> Except, guys, you don't need to sleep on a basketball court. And by the way, we have permanently removed any memory of that experience. <laughs> this is truly the day the Lord has made, so we rejoice and glorify Him in it. Marianne hastens to tell people that when she and Ferdi came and told me about this, I said no, no way, forget it. And given the opportunity again, I would probably say the same thing again, because on paper it doesn't work. His words, honestly. <laughs> they are so different in many ways, yet through these years and through their love for one another, I think we have all observed this difference become complementary. They complement and complete one another. They make each other whole. I have seen such a profound effect of Ferdi on Marianne, and likewise Marianne on Ferdi. And I'm confident that if they continue the way they have started, that this will blossom into an even more beautiful relationship from here on. I must thank them for their dedication and their ministry over the past years. I have seen such faithfulness, commitment and stamina from them individually and collectively. And know that if they invest only but part of this in each other, that they will grow in every way. I wish you every blessing today and assure you that today we only gather to mark the beginning of your marriage but that you will be in my prayers constantly. And with all those gathered here today, we dedicate ourselves to you as a community, as a family, and are enriched by this new family that becomes part of us. As we celebrate the resurrection of Christ, we are assured that he only wants joy for us and that this joy may be complete. Today, we pray for the completeness of your joy and we pray that being now one body, one heart, one mind, and one spirit, you go forth and bless the world with your presence. I stand here as a father, not me. <laughs> I stand here on behalf of Sayyidna as a father, <laughs> a brother and a friend to both Ferdi and Marianne, and must, as their father, express how proud I am of them for what they have made each other and what they will be in and for each other from this day on. God bless you both and God bless you all. Thank you, Amir. And for those who don't know who Amir is, Amir is the best man today. Um, my best friend. I am the best man. And actually, yeah, um, this is particularly poignant because Amir is getting married in a couple of months himself. 